What is going on, lunatics, in an ecosystem that continues and continues to evolve? We're going to talk today about some of the projects that we've presented to you. We're going to kind of move back through. I've got another one coming up. We're going to talk about some of the wallets that are available for you to easily trade your Luna Classic in this ecosystem. And I'm getting it all mapped out for you right now. So exciting things are coming. And there's still the risk in this market right now of more downward momentum. So I want you to be careful with your trading. That said, we're going to look at some places where you can do some trading, especially Luna Classic. So if you like this type of content, make sure you hit the like button, subscribe button, and the bell to be notified of future content. Now, if you're looking to do some trading today, right now, Weeks is the place to do it. If you are not with Binance, Binance does a burn every single month. Weeks is the only other exchange doing burns. I implore you, this helps tremendously. If you're look, if you're holding on and you're never going to sell or anything like that, and you're just a bag hodler, then you know no need for you to sign up. Unless you want to support me and the channel, cool. Or Terra Casino, for that matter, if you want to support the channel. And by the way, they burn as well, and they are brought to you by Terraport. Uh, so, you know, all of this is kind of intertwined and together, not with weeks, but it, the Terra Casino, Terraport, all of this stuff. Uh, and, and I'm going to show you some trading pairs on Terraport today so that you can actually go in and you can start trading and earning. And look, if you want to make money, that's how you do it, right? So let's go look at it and let's check it out. But again, if you want to try start trading at weeks because they do a monthly burn as well. Uh, and then, of course, Terra Casino. Uh, that being said, let's get into some of the news. We'll kick this off. Uh, we'll try to get this through as quickly as possible. I know I'm a little long-winded every once in a while. First of all, no real news to report on Duquan or Terraform Labs. Nothing that's really altering in any way. However, this right here, Terra Luna Classic Community Pool hits 5 billion lunk. Is it good or bad? The community pool balance surpasses 5 billion lunk as development activity and total value locked falls on the chain. So uh, Terra Luna Classic Community Pool balances hit an all-time high of $5 billion, a milestone for the community as more funds remain available for developers and other contributors. However, the development activity decline is a big reason to worry as per TVL and commits data of the chain. to uh, The Lunk Community Pool has $5 billion Lunk and $11.8 million USTC as per current data by stake bin. However, the community hasn't been able to utilize the available funds to its capacity risking capitulation and losing progress on revival efforts. So if we're not paying people to do stuff, if we're not, you know, like, I, for example, um, I, I don't build anything. I don't do anything. I'm just a promoter, right? Uh, so if you're not promoting anything, if you're not doing anything and you're just sitting on that money right there, well, then people are going to know or people are going to think developers that there's nothing to be built here. So why would they make the effort? You know what I mean? Like, like it, it, you should you should notice that that you know, we've kind of dipped down here. And the other thing is there's still development going on, but uh, you, you got to get into that community pool. And look, if you have a bunch of bad actors prohibiting, and I tell you this, and I repeat this over and over again until I'm blue in the face, there are bad actors out here. The reason that this pool, in my opinion, is swelling up so much despite what they're telling me right here, despite all of that, what they're telling me, the Dow is voting down progress every step of the way and you if you are staking with people like jesus is lord jesus is lord too those kind of guys that are voting no to everything that advances the the blockchain because they say it's to protect the finances of the blockchain uh again you can't spend money uh, you, you can't make money unless you spend money in order to make an investment you have to put in money and invest money so i mean what are we really doing here so that should be concerning to you and you should be looking at that in that way. And, and you know, I shouldn't be telling you what you should be doing. Uh, what I mean to say is that's the way that I look at it. Okay. Uh, furthermore, the total value locked on the chain has also dropped from 7.5 million in December of 2023 to 2.27 million at the time of writing. Now, part of that is the massive dump in price. So misleading guys, CoinGape, uh, it occurs to me right here is maybe just reading the data, maybe just reading the data, but also appears to be something of a bad actor because if you're taking the total value locked at say 25, three zeros 25, and then you're saying, well, 7.5 million locked up. And now you're saying today there's only 2.27 million. Well, price is four zeros, nine, something like that. Uh, yeah, no shit. 
Um, but this is still better than it was, you know, um, eight, nine months ago. Though The work on bringing back utility is ongoing by multiple groups, but seems to have failed to bring in more developers and projects on the chain. Um, and that is a fair assessment because, you know, of course, this it, we're not in the bull market yet. We're, we're, we're just coming out of this bear market. It, Bitcoin is different. Bitcoin's a different animal. I'm talking about altcoins. We're, you know, we're just we're just not there yet. The contributions from projects such as Astroport, TerraSwap, Eris Protocol, Saluna, and others are low, falling 5 to 8% in the last 24 hours. Uh, this guy, well, what if Bitcoin is dropping and dropping and dropping and all the altcoins are dropping? Is Terra Luna Classic not exploding? It's a, it's a simple. This is, I think, manipulation. My opinion, I don't know for sure, and I can't say. Varinder Singh, by the way, is the guy's name, but it just seems a little manipulative to me. Um, so, uh, meanwhile, the community has also turned down the proposal to make a dedicated team. Uh, and, and that's not done, by the way. So, now, I'm pretty sure this is locked in as these guys are, uh, th this is, you're, you're being manipulated. So this right here says that, you know, the voting is not even over yet, uh, but there's a lot of people voting no. And we're going to look at who's voting no in just a few minutes. So, you know, let me get back to this. But, uh, you know, we're looking at price plunges. You know, we're looking at all of these different pieces. Like, you know, what's going on? Well, you know, the market's been difficult. The market's been tough, uh, especially U.S. markets just been capitulating a lot. Every time the, the Euro, Euro markets or the Chinese markets pump it up a little bit, the U.S. market just steals the liquidity out of it. So, I mean, what are you going to do now? For some reason, uh, I'm going into Commonwealth and all I'm getting here is that I have to install an app. And when I hit cancel, uh, it's uh, not letting me do anything. So I, I'm not really sure what I'm going to do about this yet. I'll do this off camera a little bit later on. Now, the next question is, of course, what about price action? Well, let's check out the price action and, uh, you know, let's see what's happening. All right. So the last two hours, we had a nice little pump here to recover some of the price action from a few hours prior. But again, you know, when you're when you're writing an article about this a couple of days ago and you're seeing it down here in this range here uh, and you're, you know, down 4x, no wonder the total value locked has changed because the value has changed. So I hate when they do you know nonsense like this. Now, what we're looking at is the 100 MA right there rejected off of that simple rejecting off of it right now it's going to have to break above it if it breaks above it that becomes very bullish and we probably start to recover but again this market could be very difficult for the next couple of days we're getting to the having and we don't have any information about the having you know just just kind of causing anything to explode or or just absolutely rip you know we're not seeing it yet starting to see a little green in the market today but it's not long term yet like we're not really there yet so you know, let's see how this market kind of plays itself out over the next couple of days. And then, you know, right after the halving, how it plays out. We're only three days from the halving. So, uh, guys, I want to assure you, bull market is coming. This thing is about to get absolutely parabolic. Whether you want, you know, whether you like it or not, whether you want it or not, doesn't matter. But it's what the, mar the market will do, what the market will do. So, uh, so our station goes again. You know, we've got this this classic team and they're they're trying to, to, to stop it. Uh, the proposal to increase... Uh, max blocks. I have not read this yet, uh, but I'm going to come over here to Lunk Dash. And I'm going to say here, establish a classic team. And I'm going to click on that one. And I'm going to see who voted and how did they vote. Uh, please connect your wallet to vote. So we're going to do that. God damn it. Apparently, apparently everything about my wallet is just out of control today. So anyway, uh, here's the yeses. We got Interstellar Lounge, Lunk Development Fund, uh, POS Node, Buy Studios, etc. Lunk Forever. So who do we have that's not doing it? I mean, again, let's just go back. Uh, it, Jesus is Lord, is using all of his power to prevent you from progressing, uh, to prevent this 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 chain from progressing. Luna Classic Labs, uh, voting no, solid vote, long swap, community first, Luna Knots, LVS, Moon Rabbit. Uh, so, you know, these guys are, you know, I, I don't know what the idea is behind it um, and, and why we're doing it. But remember, uh, in order to Luna Classic Labs, the, the name of this is literally Luna Classic Labs zero fee plus auto compound. So, um, uh, you know, it, it's a little. It's, it, and I, by the way, I don't dislike anybody. I'm not, you know, I, I don't have a problem with anybody. Everybody has their own reason for doing whatever it is that they do. And they may just be voting no because they don't think it's a good idea. But um, they're they're voting in the land of what I consider to be like a bad actor at this point with Jesus is Lord, Moon Rabbit, these guys uh, out here. So, um, you know, what exactly is going on here? Uh, well, it looks like they're trying to to stop the, the team. And by the way, uh, one of the reasons that they're going to give you is to, to stop the team is because, you know, uh, they could just take money and not do anything. Well, manage it. Manage the goddamn process. You know what I mean? Like you need a manager to manage it. You don't have a manager to manage it. What are you expecting to happen here? 
you know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, I hope I hope I'm making sense here. Uh, it's just it's just phenomenally wild um, uh, what's going on here. And again, no disrespect to anybody who's um, uh, who's voting uh, one way or another. I just again, Jesus is Lord. Uh, moon rabbit to me, bad actors. So, uh, but that's the way that they're voting. And if you're voting with them, uh, you can vote however you want. But my opinion is this is something that we we absolutely need. And if you're telling me that we do not need it, you're not looking at the price action. You're not looking at the activity on the chain. You're not looking at all of the data. All of the data says we desperately need something like that to happen. Simple. So the question is, what do we do? Um, and I don't really answer that. You know, here, here's what I know. What I know is there are people building on this network. And let me show you, as a matter of fact, some of the stuff that's that's on this network that is being built. And you can see it. If you haven't already, go to terraport.finance and you can look at a lot of this. Okay. Uh, they're still in maintenance mode because they're doing an upgrade. Uh, but, you know, let's go look at this. Uh, first, we're going to look at the Lunk uh, burn tracker and uh, get you primed. All right. So 110 billion have been burned so far, 501 million in the last. Uh, seven days, you know, not a lot, but we still have a circulating supply of 5.83 trillion. Going to have to do something about that. We'll see how that goes. But you know, this is the thing right here. Uh, Terraport Classic, if you want to trade, and I have a, about, I think I have about 1.7 million uh, that I'm using on various different stuff over here for trading purposes right now. Uh, but in, you have the Luna Classic community, um, the, the, the Lunk community, and you have Terra, the token, which is the, uh, this is the the token for uh, the Terraport ecosystem. Uh, but look at what you have available here for you to trade. Uh, if you want to, cremation token, uh, Terratridium token, the Osmo token, USDT, USDC, BNB, USTC, GRDX, FRG. Remember, we covered FRG yesterday. We have the Frog token. We got Lunk Warriors. Uh, we got S Frog. We've got Lenny Lunk. Uh, we've got TD, TADF. We've got LNC. We've got Sun. We've got Food, HMeme, Raykoff, Elon, LWN, uh, Raykoff. I can't stand Raykoff. Uh, I, I love it as a project. I think it's a, it's just hilarious as a project. Uh, but uh, the 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 Jed Raykoff. If you guys don't know who he is, he's an 82 year old octogenarian, uh, dirtbag scumbag, uh, horrible horrible man of. I, I really don't like this guy. He is uh, everything that's wrong with the court systems in the United States. He's a a cuck, if you will, for. Uh, banks. He's a cuck for the system. He's ignoring Judge Annalisa Torres ruling on the XRP because he doesn't like it. He doesn't think that it makes sense. He thinks that individuals uh, can buy securities just like corporations can buy securities. So, so he disagrees fundamentally with everything. And again, I mean, the, the guy is 80 something years old and we're looking at him like he's a, you know, a, a clear thinker. You know, I think the guy's deluded. So, uh, but, but it's funny to have a meme based on him and you know guys listen there's a there's a big ecosystem out here let me go over it again so you guys can see you know what it is that you can trade over here you've got Raykoff, you've got elon you've got lwn you've got h mean food sun lnc tadf lenny lunk s frog ln uh lunw frog frag uh grdx ustc bnb usdt usdc osmo teratridium cremation lunk you can trade a whole lot of different stuff over here uh, come over here and you can certainly check it out. Uh, if you want to come in here and look at the liquidity pools, you can see what the liquidity pools are and what they have. Uh, you can come over here to earn. You can do through staking and farming. Uh, you have analytics that allow you to check in and see you know, what it is that's going on within the ecosystem and what some of these prices are and how they are, uh, how they how they run. And then down here you have, of course, the pairings uh, and how much their volume is, uh, how much is being traded, et cetera, et cetera. Uh, then you have a vesting process. You have the development, so you can check it out. And then you have governance where you can come in and you can vote on what these guys are doing over at Terraport.finance. And, you know, I was told at one point, researching crypto is so important. Guys, go to cryptonomy.finance slash research today and learn more about AI, DAOs, DeFi, gaming, layer one or layer two, uh, memes, gaming, NFTs, Web3, whatever you need to know, exploring meme coin trends, all the information is available to you. Now, make sure you sign up as a VIP or a pro member. Look at my fixed deposits, guys. You can see right now, I just put in another three ETH that I'm holding until April 5 of 2025. Let me show you the details here. So at the end of this, my scheduled interest is going to be 3.23 Ethereum. So I'm running three Ethereum for letting them hold on to it for one year as a staking process. I anticipate a fantastic payout from this.
But guys, the big money is made over here on the launch pool. Make sure that you're checking it out. I'm a bronze member. Remember, I put in about 0.48 Bitcoin with an expected rate of return of 1 to 5x. I'm taking a risk here. If I only get a 1x, I, you know, I think I'll still be fine. But uh, as you can see right now, I've already accumulated 83,691 USDT for my efforts so far. How much Bitcoin is that? It's quite a bit. Go to cryptonomy.finance today and earn for yourself. I was told at one point that that terraport.finance takes away from luna classic because uh it's its own blockchain it's not a blockchain the uh, this is uh the, the the sole purpose of this to be fair uh, is to to burn luna classic to try to come up with different ways to increase the ecosystem and to build and people can disagree with it by the way but that doesn't change the fact that it is what it is and uh so guys i i would implore you to come over here and check out terraport there are things that you know, there, there are things in this ecosystem that if we want this thing to succeed, that we as investors, you know, we have to do something with it. Weeks, come over here if you want to do some burning. Um, Terra Casino, if you want to do some burning and and you, you like a, a good gaming experience, if, if that's what you're, if that's what you're into, you can go check that out. Uh, and then Terraport.finance, if you want to do some trading. And look, uh, when you want to come over and do some trading, how hard is it to go trade right now? Luna Classic or trade on the Luna Classic blockchain. Well, Terraport.finance makes it easier. And tomorrow, I'm going to bring you some crypto wallets that are going to make it easier for you. So, you know, I'm, we're doing everything that we can, or at least the, the the ecosystem is doing everything it can to start to grow and start to build and uh, or to continue to grow and build, I should say, not start to. But, um, you know, at the end of this, where does that leave us? And uh, I think, you know, I want to say this. The future is bright for Luna Classic. There will be ups, there will be downs, there will be moments where we get nervous. We get nervous at a moment right now where Bitcoin, you know, Bitcoin's up, but Bitcoin is is, is the very cyclical, uh, trendy sort of thing right now. It goes down just a little bit. It feels like a lot because the rest of the market just kind of cap capitulates when it does. But Luna Classic is continuing to build and there are people out here uh, fighting the good fight. They don't always agree with one another. They, they're not always in uh, you know, sometimes you vote one way, sometimes you vote the other way. Everybody's not the same. However, there are some bad actors in here trying to stifle it. And there are times when, you know, good proposals get shot down because they are going to build this network up. And, you know, Luna, Terra Luna, they want to destroy Luna Classic because if you 5.5 million Luna Classic lunatics are, are, are not invested in Lunk, you'll probably be invested in Luna. And they want your money over there on that chain for their liquidity. So, you know, uh, there's a reason that they want this thing to to come down. So, you know, let's uh, rally together and let's make something happen. Weeks, Terra Casino, Terraport Finance, uh, Lenny Lunk, Frag, uh, Terra Tritium, you know, games. There's, there's, there's games all over the place. There's a bunch of different wallet. I think there's a Strath wallet, something like that, that's coming out. Uh, or that, that's come out already, a hexagon wallet, which which works very well. You know, there's there's wallets, there's there's different places that you can go. There's different things that you can do in this ecosystem. All you have to do is explore and figure it out and try, and you'll find you might even find something that you really really want there. Uh, but for now, this is not financial advice. I'm always right. Thank you so much for tuning in, and we'll talk to you again tomorrow, and we'll talk about some of these wallets that help you in this ecosystem.